Good morning, Gavilan Peak. We have a ton of announcements today, so I am going to get started really quickly. Remember, Mr. P's way to be is celebrate success. Um, I am going to start with sports announcements, basketball and spirit line information. Again, any sixth to eighth grade students interested in participating in basketball or spirit line, please make sure you do do your online packet. Your paperwork needs to be filled out as soon as possible because it does start on February 25th. Cross country again, fifth through eighth grade for cross country if you're interested. Uh, make sure you do do your online athletic packet. Um, cross country will also start February 25th. If you have basketball or spirit line questions, please go ahead and see Miss McFarlane. If you have anything on cross country, please see Miss Darice. Next from me is some leaves. As you can see, we have new, more towards spring leaves. So, first one is a thank you for being an amazing brother to Ryland from Hayden. That's very nice and thoughtful. Uh, thank you for taking care of GP and thanks for being our nurse. That's uh, Nurse Danielle, and that's from Marissa. And thank you so thank you for being so sweet. You make going to school fun, and that is to Weaver from Madeline. All right, Mrs. Garcia. Thank you. I have a few to share as well. This first one, thank you for being a great teacher and helping me when you can. That's to Miss Yath from Shay. Next one, thank you for being an amazing teacher. You make learning new things so much fun. To Mrs. Donat from Chloe. And the last one I have is you are the best little sister ever. I love you. You are so cute. And that's to Marissa from Emma. I like that we're sharing with our teachers and our family. All right, if we think about our EQ motto this week, we are, I can drop my shoulders and I can take a few breaths and I can handle this. I wanna remind you that nothing good ever comes from anger. So taking that second to kind of gain self-control, taking that breath, relaxing for a minute and thinking before acting is actually really, really powerful. So don't let your emotions take over. Just take a minute and breathe and you'll find that you have a lot better results. All right. Now it is the fun part of our announcements. We went through hundreds, and I really mean hundreds. Over 500 entries were submitted for some really fabulous names for our mascot. We narrowed it down, and then you guys voted one final time in your homerooms. So our choices were... All right, so our choices were Phoenix, Ablaze, Frenzy, Molten, and Ember. Um, it was narrowed down, and I will tell you, people such as Shay, Hayden, um, Ashland, and Emmy uh, definitely got uh, the correct name that we ended up choosing. We do have one winner from a drawing of people who suggested the winning name. But before I tell you the winning name and who was the winner for that, uh, we do have a contest that was drawing our mascot, and I will tell you fifth grade Eve number one yay okay. and number two Carson who Very also nice. happens to have chose the name of our new mascot as well and his name was drawn for the gift card so our drawing winners and our name winners please come up to the office but the new name for our mascots is Blaze. So Blaze is our Firebird. So it is finally chosen. He is up in his nest above the gym and now has a name. So congratulations, Carson. Thanks for suggesting that name and everyone else who did. Um, it is truly, truly exciting to have a name to him. It is. Welcome Blaze to GP. All right, guys. Have an awesome Thursday. We will see you again tomorrow on Friday. And remember, we, we are, are GP. GP.